battery's charged. I guess you could say, or my son might say, with those boots, the flannel pajamas, and the white t-shirt, I guess I could be classified as country boy fresh. What do you think? Sarah's not wearing her, uh, she's not ready for her close up, Mr. DeVille. It's okay though. Like they always said, you can take the girl out of the trailer park. But you can't take the trailer park out of the girl. I was not born and raised in a trailer park, so I am not trailer park. There's nothing wrong with trailer park. I was talking to Christian yesterday, and we basically live in a trailer park without walls right now, or without fences. So there's a just like a handful of of regular like normal house houses and the rest of them are manufactured homes spirit lake park there is a difference between a manufactured home and a trailer well what's oak crest called it's just oak crest now i'm not showing i'm not going to tape you promise no keep that camera pointing at you it's pointed at me. People want to see me anyway. All four people that watch my videos. I don't even. Sarah doesn't even watch the videos I upload to YouTube. It's because I'm usually there when you're taping them. Yeah, maybe. I don't think my kids do either. I don't think. I don't know who does actually. I know people. I get views on some of them. But. Yeah, I don't care. I just do it because I've always liked video. We're going to get Christian from uh, work. He works at the Silverwood theme park in Athol. Athol, A-T-H-O-L. Not a dirty word. And it's not a big deal or anything, but I'm gonna video, take video when we're driving into the back entrance. Not a lot of people get to see what it looks like at the employee side of a of a uh, theme park, so. I mean, it's not a Disneyland or anything. It might as well be for the prices they charge, but. It's weird too, because it's out in the middle of what looks like fields and forest. There's just this theme park. start to see what's that called aftershock. aftershock yeah you can just see aftershock here it's blue and green we get to stop for another train one train on one line we got this train here and then hey maybe if we're lucky we'll have to stop for the Silverwood theme park train who knows anyway I don't know how anybody could want to live like a big city or anything when you've got stuff like this all over mountains green and sky The most exciting thing ever. Here it comes. Woo! It's better than being there. It's pretty cool for being middle of North Idaho. Well, yeah, I guess it is the middle of North Idaho. Not too bad. We go, well, we try to go once a year ish. Water park 
truck is up there a bit. I don't know the details like I'm a historian or anything, but the radio commercials and stuff say that there's like 221 acres here. So I guess that's not too bad. I don't know how big other theme parks are. Like uh, Disneyland, Disneyland and stuff like that. But anyway, I'm getting ready to pick up the boy.